The Peninsular Plateau of India is bounded on both sides by coastal plains that extend along the Arabian Sea on the west and the Bay of Bengal on the east. The eastern coastal plains go from West Bengal in the north to Tamil Nadu in the south, passing through Andhra Pradesh and Odisha along the way. It has deltas of the rivers Mahanadi, Krishna, Kaveri and Godavari. On the other hand, the western coastal plains go from Kerala in the south to Gujarat in the north, passing through Karnataka, Goa and Maharashtra along the way. You can find several lagoons along the Malabar coast here. The western coastal plains are devoid of any delta but instead form estuaries. The formation of a delta by a river requires heavy sediments and siltation, but the western coastal plain and the western ghats do not provide enough sediment and silt to form the delta. Let's check out why is it so. The Deccan Plateau is eastward sloping, that is the western coast is elevated compared to the eastern coast, so because of the higher gradient, the rivers cannot collect a large amount of silt and flow at a very high speed compared to the east flowing rivers. Hence, there is no ground available for delta formation at the western ghats. These western coastal plains are an example of submerged coastal plains. Such coasts have active tides that make them unsuitable for delta formation. The western flowing rivers originate from the western ghats and the distance between the western ghats and the coastal waters is very short. So the span of the flow of the west flowing rivers is shorter. Like the Himalayas, sedimentary rocks are not very common in the western ghats. These ghats are composed of metamorphic and igneous rocks which are harder than the sedimentary ones. As a result, they do not provide sufficient sediment to the rivers. Eventually, these rivers are unable to widen their mouths into the sea, as a result they form estuaries. Whereas the eastern rivers flow through broken hills and mountain ranges. So they are widened and flow with less velocity, depositing sediments and silt before entering the sea and forming a delta. Rainfalls are highly seasonal, there is a dramatic rise of waters during monsoons. The western coastal plains and the adjoining western ghats is a water surplus zone of India. 3% of the area in geographical expense receives 18% of rainfall. The huge discharge flushes out sediments into the deeper seas. So these were the reasons why there is an absence of deltas on the western coastal plains of India. That's all. See you in the next video. Thank you.